Today is April 16th, 2020, and this is the day that we were supposed to be done with the stay home lockdown order. This was supposed to be day one of our brave new world where we could venture outside freely and start going back to normal. And that is not the case. Our one month stay home, stay safe order got extended by our governor and we are in day one of a 30 day extension. So here we are, stay home, part de. <sighs> and I'm losing my mind. As we hinted at in a previous video, C4 has repackaged its original line of drinks. They now fall under the banner of C4 Original with a can redesign and new approach to differentiate itself from its new Smart Energy line. The original C4 formula is now C4 Explosive Energy plus Performance. As to what that actually means, I don't know. The main differentiator between the C4 original and the Smart Energy is the presence of beta alanine. I don't know if the original drinks contain more or less, but I do know they have beta alanine. Worth noting, the beta alanine that the new drinks contain are so substantial that they are the second ingredient on the list after carbonated water. Carbonated water, beta alanine. Number two. That's uh, substantial there, bud. So this will be interesting. Will this have the same effect of all the other C4s with the tingly dinglies or anything else along those lines? Or will it be something else entirely? I'm gonna crack into this. This is C4 Twisted Lime Aid. <coughs> Cheers, stay caffeinated, stay happy. This is interesting. This is a nice, subtle lime flavor. It's like a lime popsicle. Usually the flavor of lime is presented in a diluted form, often combined with lemon and other generic citric acid taste. It's subtle, it's sweet, it doesn't have much bite to it, and it's not very tart. I expected a bit more tartness, maybe not enough to make my eye pucker, but I expected a bit more. Not saying that's a bad thing, just a statement. This probably isn't the best thing to be drinking when you're working a desk job. I don't necessarily like the redesign on the cans. They took the design elements from the new uh, Super Brain line. It's just not as eye-catching and texturally appealing as the old design that had the textured surface and you know looked like something out of a video game. In all honesty, this. Yeah, it looks roughly the same, but you get up close and it doesn't feel as premium, but that's just my observation. Oh, yes. This is a nice flavor. It's not a memorable one, but it's a nice flavor. I enjoy it. That's the long and the short of it. Would I go out of my way to try this again? Probably not, in all honesty. C4 still doing good things. I don't know why that first shipment of drink we got, that's was so drastically different in the flavor department and all the ones I've tried since I've been smoother, mellower, easier on the palate. The world may never know. But Twisted Limeade, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna give this a seven. It's not a bad score. It's not a bad drink. It's just... Eh. There's not a whole lot of praise I can give it. It just... It is. It exists. It's good. It exists. But... Beyond that, it's not rewriting any rules. It's not hitting one out of the park. It's just there. It's batter on first. Contemplates stealing second, but doesn't. It's a nice, safe drink. If you've managed to try any of these original C4 flavors, did you have that beta alanine tingly dingly effect in your extremities? Let me know in the comment section down below. Give us a like if you like this video. Subscribe if you haven't already. But until next time, I'm Eric the Red. Stay caffeinated, stay happy. If you're still under stay home order, stay safe, and we'll get through this. Might as well <sighs> drive ourselves nuts because we're already there. Flavor. 200 milligrams of caffeine. We shall see how it goes. It's a nice fresh boy, nice fresh one. It's good until June of next year, whatever.
we're still in lockdown, so.